Learn Python fast and or operator. X is 5, Y is 3. If this and this are both true, it will print 2. If only one of these two things is true, that's why we have the or, then it will print this. What do you think it will print? Take a guess. Let's see. 2 and 2. Next. Bring code to next line. If sometimes we have a really long line here uh, and we, we can't see all the code, it goes to the next line, we, we want to bring it down. So what can we do? If we try to do this, it will not work. It gives error. So if we do this thing where we can put a backslash in Python to bring something to the next line, this still does not work. So how do we do it? We have to make sure there are no spaces after this slash, and then when we do it, it will give us correct. Next, get element from string. String, how are you? Print string 5, A12468. What do you think it's going to print? It prints this. Why? Because we start at index 0. Next, first and last element from string or array. Uh, this is a trick. If you put negative 1, it will give you the last element. And remember, 0 is the first element. So we get 8 and 2. Next, change directory and get current directory. Sometimes you need to be in a certain directory to use certain packages or get certain files. So here, get current working directory. It's going to tell you what my directory is. And it looks like this. I have cut off the first 19 characters or so of my, of my string that it returned. So all you can see is this. Before this, it said blah, 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 users, and my name. Next, change directory. You can change directory to whatever you want. Uh, just put your path in here. It's going to give an error because this is not, not correct. Click on the next video uh, here for the next part.